Paris is a city that needs no introduction. Known for its romantic ambiance, rich history, and stunning architecture, Paris is one of the most visited cities in the world. However, there is much more to see and explore beyond the popular tourist destinations in Paris. In this insider's guide to Paris and beyond, we will take you on a journey to discover 10 must-see attractions and hidden gems in and around Paris. Palace of Versailles Just a short train ride from Paris, the Palace of Versailles is a must-see attraction for any visitor to the region. This opulent palace was built during the reign of Louis XIV and served as the royal residence until the French Revolution. Visitors can explore the palace's ornate rooms, grand hall of mirrors, and stunning gardens. The Palace of Versailles is open every day except Monday from 9 a.m. to 6.30 p.m. during peak season and until 5.30 p.m. during off-peak season. Admission costs 20 euros for adults and the gardens are free to enter. The Louvre Museum The Louvre Museum is a must-visit attraction for any art lover or history buff. The museum's vast collection is spread over three wings and covers an impressive 60,000 square meters of exhibition space. The Louvre's extensive collection includes works from various civilizations, including Egyptian, Greek, and Roman antiquities, Islamic art, European paintings, and decorative arts. The museum's most famous painting, the Mona Lisa, is housed in the Denon Wing. The Louvre is the world's largest art museum, housing over 380,000 objects and 35,000 works of art. Another must-see work of art in the Louvre is the Winged Victory of Samothrace. This stunning Hellenistic sculpture depicts the goddess Nike, Victory, standing atop a ship's prow, her wings spread wide as if in flight. The statue is displayed in the Daru Staircase, which was specially designed to showcase this masterpiece. The Venus de Milo is another famous sculpture on display at the Louvre. This ancient Greek statue depicts the goddess Aphrodite, Venus, and is believed to have been created between 130 and 100 BCE. The Louvre is open every day except Tuesday from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. and until 9.45 p.m. on Wednesdays and Fridays. Admission costs 17 euros for adults, and admission is free on the first Sunday of every month. Eiffel Tower The Eiffel Tower is perhaps the most iconic landmark in Paris and one of the most recognizable structures in the world. Built by Gustave Eiffel for the 1889 World's Fair, stands at 324 meters tall, the tower was initially intended to be a temporary structure. However, it quickly became a symbol of Paris and has since become a permanent fixture in the city's skyline. The tower has three levels accessible to visitors each offering a unique perspective on the city. The first and second levels can be accessed by both elevator and stairs, while the third level can only be reached by elevator. The first level features a glass floor and several exhibits on the tower's history and construction. The second level offers stunning views of the city, including the Champs-Élysées, the Arc de Triomphe, and the Seine River. The third level offers uninterrupted views of the city, and is the highest observation deck in Europe. The Eiffel Tower is open every day from 9 a.m. to midnight during peak season and from 9.30 a.m. to 11 p.m. during off-peak season. Admission prices vary depending on the level you wish to visit. The cost to access the top floor is 26 euros for adults, while the cost to access the second floor is 16.50 euros. Notre Dame Cathedral Although Notre Dame Cathedral suffered significant damage in a fire in 2019, it remains one of the most iconic landmarks in Paris. Located on the Ile de la Cité, this Gothic masterpiece dates back to the 12th century and is famous for its flying buttresses and stunning stained glass windows. While the cathedral is currently closed for renovations, visitors can still admire its exterior and take a stroll around the Ile de la Cité. It is expected to reopen to the public in 2024. Montmartre Montmartre is a neighborhood in Paris, known for its artistic heritage and bohemian vibe. The area is located on a hill in the northern part of the city and offers stunning views of the Paris skyline. Montmartre has a rich history as a gathering place for artists, writers, and musicians, 
and its streets are filled with charming cafes, galleries, and boutiques. One of the most iconic landmarks in Montmartre is the Basilica of the Sacre Coeur. This stunning basilica is located at the top of the hill and offers breathtaking views of the city. The basilica was built in the late 19th century as a symbol of hope and reconciliation following the Franco-Prussian War. Visitors can climb the 234 steps to the top of the dome for an even more impressive view of the city. Fontainebleau Palace The Fontainebleau Palace is a magnificent Renaissance palace located just outside of Paris in the town of Fontainebleau. The palace was built in the 16th century and was once the residence of French kings and emperors, including Francois I, Henry IV, and Napoleon Bonaparte. The palace is renowned for its opulent architecture, stunning artwork, and beautiful gardens. The palace's architecture is a mix of Renaissance and French Baroque styles, with intricate carvings, ornate moldings, and grand staircases. Visitors can explore the palace's many rooms, including the ballroom, the Gallery of Francis I, and the Napoleon Museum. These rooms are filled with stunning artwork, including paintings by Titian, Raphael, and Leonardo da Vinci, as well as exquisite furniture, tapestries, and sculptures. The Fontainebleau Palace is open every day except Tuesday from 9.30 a.m. to 6 p.m. and until 5 p.m. during off-peak season. Admission costs 14 euros for adults and an additional euro five for access to the gardens. Chateau de Chantilly Located just outside of Paris, the Chateau de Chantilly is a hidden gem that is worth the trip. This stunning Renaissance chateau was once the home of the Duke of Omal and features an impressive collection of art and artifacts, including works by Raphael and Botticelli. Visitors can explore the chateau's opulent rooms and take a stroll through its extensive gardens, which include a beautiful French-style garden and an English-style garden. The Chateau de Chantilly is open every day except Tuesday from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. and until 5 p.m. during off-peak season. Admission costs 17 euros for adults and an additional 8 euros for access to the stables and the Great Stables Museum. Sainte-Chapelle Located on the Ile de la Cité, Sainte-Chapelle is a stunning Gothic chapel that is famous for its stunning stained glass windows. Built in the 13th century, the chapel was once the home of the Crown of Thorns, and its windows depict scenes from the Old and New Testaments. Visitors can explore the chapel's upper level and admire its stunning architecture and intricate details. Saint Chapelle is open every day from 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. during peak season and until 5 p.m. during off-peak season. Admission costs 11.50 euros for adults. Musée d'Orsay The Musée d'Orsay is one of Paris's most popular museums, located on the left bank of the Seine in a stunning Beaux-Art train station. The museum is renowned for its collection of Impressionist and Post-Impressionist art, housed in a vast and airy space that is an artwork in itself. Visitors to the Musée d'Orsay can explore a wide range of art, from paintings and sculptures to decorative arts and photography. The museum's collection includes some of the most famous works of the Impressionist and Post-Impressionist movements, including Monet's Water Lilies, Van Gogh's Starry Night, and Renoir's Luncheon of the Boating Party. The museum is open every day except Monday from 9.30 a.m. to 6 p.m. and until 9.45 p.m. on Thursdays. Admission costs 14 euros for adults, and admission is free on the first Sunday of every month. Musée Rodin The Musée Rodin is a museum located in the heart of Paris that is dedicated to the works of the famous French sculptor Auguste Rodin. The museum is housed in a beautiful mansion that was once Rodin's home and studio, and it showcases a vast collection of his sculptures, drawings, and other works of art. The Musée Rodin's collection includes some of Rodin's most famous works, including The Thinker, The Kiss, and The Gates of Hell. Visitors can explore the museum's many rooms, which are filled with sculptures, drawings, and other works of art from the 19th and 20th centuries. 
The museum's collection also includes works by other artists who were influenced by Rodin, such as Camille Claudel and Antoine Bordel. The Musée Rodin is open every day except Monday from 10 a.m. to 5.45 p.m. during peak season and until 4.45 p.m. during off-peak season. Admission costs 13 euros for adults, and admission to the gardens only costs 4 euros.